winds of a van goes round and round, round and round, round and round. The winds of a van goes round and round all through the town. How are you today? I hope you're okay. I'm fine too. We have just wherever you are. Are you okay? Wow, nice. It's your teacher Anonsieta. Welcome to Easy Elimo Learning Simplified. Wow. We've been doing numbers. We wrote numbers 1 to 5. We wrote numbers 1 to 10. And here we are. You want to learn writing and writing numbers 1 to 15. Who can just remind us a quick review of what we did in the two previous lessons? In the two previous lessons, we started with number 1 and we were able to write it in words. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very good. And someone was telling me, wow, teacher, now we can be able to write these numbers very fast and very well in words and in figures. Very good. Very good. So we did five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And the one we did here was which number? It was a ten. How do we form? The next number after 10. How do we form the next number after 10? Remember, normally numbers are supposed to start reading from 0. And when you read 0 here, up here, then the number 1 follows. You read number 0 up here, then number 1 follows. 0 is written as Z R O. A Z E R O. So, how do we form number 10? Number 10. Now, after you reach number 9, we now go back to the numbers. These are the main numbers. These are the main numbers. Even if you go up to 1,000, you can never miss these numbers in your numbers. So, when you reach to number 9, you now come back to the, the number 0. But now, for you to form number 10, you will need this 1 and a 0 to form a number 10. For you to form a number 12, and number 11, this is 10, formed after 1 and 0, which will appear here. Now we want to form the teens, the numbers that appear between number 10 to 15. How do I form the next number? So I will still go back to 1, 1, which I'll form a number. Then I come and form a number from 12. Basically, it is 10 plus 1 to get this 11. 10 plus 2 to get this 12. 10 plus 3 to get this the next number. 10 plus 4 you get the next number. And 10 plus 5 gives me the next number. So how do you write these numbers in words? How do you write these numbers in words? We are now say this one is E L E V E N and the word is 11. We go E L E V N E and the word is 11. Then how do we form? From the word 2. From the word 2. We form the word 2 elf. Good. Now from the word 2 we have said we form the word 12. And how do we spell the word 12? T W E L V E. Then from the word three, you form the word thirteen. From the word three, you form the word thirteen. And how do you spell the word thirteen? It is T H I R T double E N. Then from the word four, you form the word four. Teen. Four. Teen. 
and then from the word five, we form the word fifteen. Very good. So up to there. Is there a problem? No. So during your own free time, during your own free time, practice writing these numbers in words. Right in words by filling in right in words by filling in so we have So, with the help of your guardians, I want to see people practicing how to write these numbers in words by filling in the missing numbers. Fill in the missing numbers. When we meet tomorrow, I want to see this work well done so that we can be able to know who did not understand and who understood how to write numbers 1 to 15 in words. Up to there. Is there any problem? Is there something that you need clarification? If not, I wish you well and I hope to see you in the next lesson as we continue to write numbers 1 to 20 in words. Thank you very much.